We've been told to trust in the Lord with all our hearts. But many of us take the position of God, I'll trust you here, here, and here. But when it comes to my money and situation, you just can't go there. I know, lean not on my own understanding. But me and God got this understanding that he ain't never been here to go through what I'm struggling with, so he just can't understand me. And all your ways acknowledge me, which I do, but not really at work. I mean, they know I go to church. I just feel it's not the time or place to be discussing Christ's work. So yeah, I'll participate in the bad jokes and the inappropriate comments, but it's cool, because I go to church. I mean, it's not that I don't love God. I just want to be accepted. If I stand up and start preaching, then I'm going to get rejected and feel disconnected so much as about God get deflected. Like, let's talk about sports. Or the latest fashion in magazines. Then we got the nerve to wonder why this world is so diseased. It's because no one is preaching the gospel or living the Christian proper. By Christian proper, I mean the actual Christian show the practice of addiction and change the living and now walking like it's fiction. I'm sorry. Where did all the Christians go? They didn't go anywhere, but they're hiding in broad daylight. And to me, that's wild. On Sundays, they're not reaching out. They just peeking through the windows. We in a war for souls. If you check the tally, it's looking like our wind's low. We need to treat this like it's 96 in Chicago. The family matters. We need to get our full house together and trust in the strong tower. Jehovah Jireh, the Lord provides. El Shaddai, God Almighty. Yahweh Sidku, the Lord my righteous. Yeshua Yamashiach, Jesus the Prince of Peace, Hakadosh Israel, the Holy One of Israel. But how can we pray to the God whose name we don't know? So we're sick, throwing our prayers up on deaf ears and wondering why we feel so low. We're trying to get to God without Jesus. The problem is, as believers, we don't believe in Jesus. But Jesus said, I'm the only way to God. Read John. When the Pharisees pressed him, tested the question, he looked back and was like, God's for real? I'm the only way to God. Read John 6, 66. Many of his disciples stopped following him. Now a disciple is more than a casual following, but it's one of them who walked with him, talk with him, ate with him, and prayed with him. But when Jesus said, drop it all and trust him, they fell back like, nah, bro, I just can't play with him. Do we want Christ, or do we want his miracles? If we never get another thing, will we still say we trust in him? Still say we walk with him and talk with him? Can't y'all see I just want to love with him? Can you feel me, Lord? Sanctification is a lifelong process and I need you to heal me, Lord. My entire life is hinged on the death, burial, and resurrection of Jesus Christ of Nazareth for the atonement of my sins. So God, I trust you with all my heart. I'm not leaning on my own understanding. In all my ways will I acknowledge you. And I direct my path. Like only in my heart.